Hello and welcome to my first train review video. Today I'm doing a review on the trains from the West Coast Highlander, which currently on the Hornley website is 64.99. Now I've set the track up already and put the train on the track, which is just over there. And I think it's time we put the power on. Now, this little punt is quite a fast one, and free stop it there, and get it. You can have a look, it's a zero four zero style punt and if you can see it in there I know I can but I'm not sure if you viewers can you can just about see the motor which is quite powerful as you clearly have seen now the couplers are just basic and this whole layout is the basic oval and the starter pack A. And that's the power it came with. So if you place it on there, not that bad, and set it in the other direction, it will also go at speed, and as you can see, and here it derailed all the other coaches and sent that carriage down to there. But can it pull up the train or can it pull them back on the track? No, it's too powerful. So if we just put them back on. back towards them. Now this sort of power is, that sort of power is a bit fiddly because say if you've got it there, you can't exactly push it there because it could potentially muck it up. But if it's like this on zero power, you can then change it. Like so. arrived on Monday the 29th, no, the 30th of December 2013, which is also when I went to Birmingham and Kidderminster to buy that. And that blanket is not mine, it's my cat. But this came from my Harry Potter train set, and this, this one came from this GWR mixed traffic train set, and, well, it doesn't work, this one, and the power is the old type of power, but I went to a train model shop, or a model shop in Kidderminster, and brought 
this class 153 it didn't come in a box though but 35 quid not bad at all and I also bought this AEC rail car by um by Lima collection for £39.50 and this is a repaint someone painted it specially and the shop I brought it from is called Foot Plate which is an amazing place currently they have an APT set in 100 not quid but that's not bad and I brought this from Inan this class 150 for £82.99 brand new and um, that will be coming up in one of my future videos anyway let's get back to this so return of power on my well that is what it looks like and I'm just gonna play it well, I'm just gonna run it with no dragons on. Now that's for power. I mean, it's a bit difficult to keep up with it. So if I just keep the camera in one place. And you've seen what goes like there. If you stick it the other way around. What's it like? Still quite fast, but not as fast. Obviously, because it is going in reverse. But now we stop it and look at the detail. So the detail, as you can see, is a WC. It's a WCR, which means West Coast Railways, I think. Not too sure, and it's got. And quite good riveting detail on the front, and it's little wheels. You can't spin them on their own because they need to be moving. And the cab, quite detailed, but it's still a bit. Bad and coupling, just the basics. So, if you leave down in the comments what you want me to review next, my 150, my 121, or my 153, or any other trains that you like, I can buy, but it may take a while for me to, well purchase it due to me spending 157 quid on them too and on that one oh and this is the weathered one just in case you were wondering but anyway leave down in the comments what you want and I'll see you next time oh and don't forget to like and subscribe because this is the bus, train and games channel which is just called Cody Cup because that's my name with Google being total jackasses. Okay, so thanks for watching.